Hi guys, got a request from Matthew Yi to make a rubber band powered car with four DVDs, glue, two axles, rubber bands, cardboard chassis with a notch and no hot glue. I haven't made a rubber band powered car for, what, two or three days? <laughs> oh well, we'll see what we can do. I've got some cardboard here. It's a bit thinner than I'd normally use, so I'll stick it together so it's double thickness, make it a little bit stiffer. Uh, I'll get some drinking straws. I've got some up here. Oh, short bits. Yeah, I've got some drinking straws over here. So they'll do for the axles to go through. Looks like a couple of barbecue skewers, so those will do for the axles. Um, DVDs, I'll have to have a little search in my box, see if I've got some. And you can't use hot glue, so... Didn't say what glue he could use. Certainly I can use this um, glue stick to stick the cardboard together. Not quite sure about the DVDs. I might use super glue. I don't like super glue at all, to be honest, but I'll give it a try this time just to see if it'll work. Right, first thing I'll do is cut this cardboard and stick it together. It's already got a groove across it, so I'll use that as the reference point. So I'll glue them together a bit of a weight on them to hold them down while we get on with the rest of the work and then I'll trim it up for the chassis. put something heavy on top of that and leave it to one side to dry. Okay, first problem, got no DVDs so we're going to use CDs. I don't think that's going to be a big problem. Um, got some milk bottle tops. I've noticed these ones have actually got a little marking right in the centre so that'll be handy. So I've got four with markings in the centre and four without. So I'll put these on one side and those on the other and that will help me when I want to make the marking, make the hole through. So we'll try using some of this stuff. As I say, I don't like it, but we'll give it a try. Probably find it won't actually stick this sort of plastic. There's only one way to find out. Try. Hmm. Just hold it still for a while. Back to my piece of cardboard that I've double thicknessed. Cut a slot or a notch out of one end so we can 
wrap the rubber band around the axle. I didn't make it any specific width, it happens to be 13 centimetres wide. So that means if I come in that four centimetres that side and four centimetres that side. That should be big enough. straw at one end, just a little bit wider than the width of the cardboard. And before we put that on, I've got a bit, bit of bent paper clip that I'm going to tape it in place, because that's something to hook the rubber band onto. So tape, I've got some parcel tape somewhere. just to be safe. Right, so that's our bent paper clip to hook the rubber band onto. Next we're going to tape the axle there. even. our front axle in place or axle tube. Now we need to do the same at the back with some short sections. That's just a bit too long. I expect I could put it... yeah let's cut it, cut it first. I'll 
start with a small piece just so I can get it in position. Okay, so that should hold the back axle. Right, now let's find out whether those wheels stick together. These particular milk bottle tops are actually quite soft. You might be able to just push your barbecue skewer, barbecue skewer straight through but I'm going to use my pointy metal braddle, as it's called, to push the hole through first. Let's start with this one. If you're pushing right the way through, make sure you keep hold of this bottle top or you'll just push it straight off the CD, DVD. There's our car. All we need is some rubber bands and we'll go and give it a test run. Test run time. Got some rubber bands joined together already. So I'll put them through that little bent paper clip. Loop it round itself. There we go. I'll just wrap it round its self on the back axle so that holds it in place Put it on the start line and let it go So that's just done the five metres of my kitchen. <laughs> Hit the end hard enough to roll nearly all the way back. That's good. We'll do another run and this time I'll chase it. If you're ready, we'll chase it this time. Here we go. Excellent. Better do a quick summary. So, oh, camera nearly fell over. So, off we got cardboard chassis, barbecue skewers for the axles, drinking straws for the axle tubes, 
a bent paper clip to hook the rubber band onto, parcel tape to hold the axle tubes at the front and the back, and the CDs that I've used because I didn't have any DVDs are glued to these bottle tops or the bottle tops are glued to the CDs using super glue which I don't like using but it's worked so I don't suppose I can knock it. There we go, job done.